In this video, we'll discuss, is your life disorganized? Now that we've addressed the clutter that builds up in the home and the workplace to cause disorganization, chaos, and poor mental health, it's time to look more closely at your life. It's very likely that your life is also suffering from some severe disorganization if you feel as if you're lacking control. What is a cluttered life? As we've already said earlier in this video course, we tend to think of clutter as a physical thing. However, all too often it can be mental or emotional too. When your life is cluttered, all that mess and disorganization is invisible. It's inside your head. Yet that doesn't make it any less stressful to deal with. In fact, it makes it even more challenging to manage. What does a disorganized life look like? How do you know if you have one? There are several signs that you can look out for to tell you that you're suffering from this problem. Firstly, you have a schedule that is overloaded with activities. You seem to be busy for every single hour of the day, with no time to spend on yourself. You feel as if you're constantly at the beck and call of other people, whether those people are friends or family members, and you struggle to fit all of your obligations, commitments, and activities into your already strained lifestyle. You feel as if you have absolutely no leisure time, when you can unwind and enjoy yourself. Or, when you do manage to grab a few moments for yourself, you feel guilty that you're not tackling the many other tasks that you have lined up ready to go. You feel under increasing pressure to be a better person, to improve yourself, and to fit the mold that the media tells us we should be in. You feel guilty when you don't have the time to cook an elaborate vegan meal from scratch, or failed to get to the gym again this week or didn't manage to get to your foreign language class so you could broaden your horizons. If you can relate to any or all of this, you have a disorganized life that needs to be decluttered urgently. Why do our lives become disorganized? There are several reasons why your life may have become disorganized. Not all will apply to everyone, but if you're experiencing the feelings we've outlined above, you'll almost certainly recognize some of them. You're neglecting your own basic needs and are therefore making poor decisions. This can lead to stress, anxiety, and obsessive thoughts that prevent you from focusing on more important areas of your life. You have a FOMO, or fear of missing out. This is a very 21st century problem, and a very common one. It's something that propels you to sign up to the gym when you simply don't have time. You take an extra class even when you're struggling with the ones you have. You scroll through Facebook for another hour rather than going to bed. Or you head out for a night at a club with friends even though you know you have to get up to work early the next morning. While FOMO comes from a place of wanting to enjoy a better life, it can end up making your life worse by adding more stress, anxiety, and distractions. You struggle to let go. This may apply to both physical and emotional baggage. Even if something is causing you pain or is making you unhappy, you still struggle to release it, and this causes you to dwell on it over and over again. You haven't learned what enough means. You still feel that you somehow have to be better, to be more perfect, to acquire more things so you can be worthy of acceptance, love, and praise. You haven't grasped the concept that good is good enough, and this leads you to obsess over things in your head that make you unhappy, unfocused, and non-productive. You can't say no. Some people just don't feel able to put their foot down, even when they really don't want to do something. They're too worried about the reaction they'll receive or about upsetting someone and losing their friendship even if they stand up for what they want and need. You feel obliged to do things, even when they aren't your responsibility. You haven't grasped the idea that delegation is a good thing, and you worry that you'll lose your importance if you allow someone else to take on a job that has always been yours. The Problems of an Overloaded Life when your life is overloaded, a host of problems can follow. The disorganization of an overpacked schedule leads you to suffer from poor mental health. You become increasingly anxious and stressed about where you're going to fit everything into your crowded day, week, or month. You also end up with no quality time for yourself, something that everyone needs from time to time to recharge their batteries. When every second of the day is accounted for, you just don't have enough time to wind down, relax, and let go of all the frustrations that you've encountered. Falling into bed at the end of a long, hard day will often lead to poor quality sleep as you struggle to process all the stresses and strains you've gone through. This only serves to make it even more difficult to find the energy and motivation to cope with the challenges that life throws at you. When your life is disorganized, you'll also find that your relationships become increasingly strained. Eventually, you'll become more frustrated, more angry, and more likely to snap at your family members and friends. This will increase tension at home and make life even more stressful and difficult. 
For more free educational content, visit learnforfree.biz. Content produced and distributed by AllSuperInfo.